So, like, I should have heard it. Um,
Okay, concert choir, come on stage. Thank you. Our next piece has a great text. It's a Swahili text, isn't it? How do we say it?
Before I forget to say this, thank you to all of these kids who made the commitment to be here tonight. Let's just give a round of applause.
blending of his classical music that had all the nuances and the intricacies of jazz really made George Gershwin the man that we all think of him today. He was born in 1898, passed away in 1937, way too soon. Love is here to stay, because our next piece by George Gershwin made its appearance in 1937, first in the old movie, The Golden Follies. And then some of you sitting out in the audience may have seen the great classic An American in Paris with Gene Kelly. And uh, that's where really this song made its mark in that movie. This was the last song that he wrote before he died. I don't know if you knew that. I didn't remember that. <laughs> and uh, his brother, who did all of his lyrics most of the time, had to finish the lyrics for the song after he passed away. So this song speaks to all of us. Deep breath. <laughs> it's been an emotional year, y'all. <laughs> for, for everybody on so many things. But love is here to stay. And I'd like to definitely give this back to you. And to all my students.
become two of my dearest students in the world. So the 2021 Choral Directors Award, which is the Legacy Award, so their names stay in the chorus room forever and ever. I agree.
next slide. And of course, we can't do what we do without the backbone behind us of all of these parents. Our leadership team of our boosters up there, I'll let you read all these names to, uh, to, to yourself. But thank you so much for your continued support through this year. Round of applause for our leadership team. Top 
Tourist is for the United States. And uh, we will have some workshops. We'll have, if this will take the place of our music performance adjudication. We will be adjudicated while we're there. And uh, we'll do a little Broadway workshop. What else are we going to do? If we have, if, when we have 40 singers, that's my goal. I need to have 40. Because if we have 40 singers on that stage, we are guaranteed one song, standalone, on the stage, just have me conducted by Connie Cox.
women with camaraderie and course rehearsals. Ori plans to go to Columbia University in New York where she will study financial economics and pursue a minor in Portuguese.
but there's somebody on the stage who uh, has checked a lot of the boxes for being an exceptional singer, musician, human, support person, comedy relief, backstage helper. I don't recall a time that this person has ever said no to me for anything. He's one of kind. Ryan Harrigan.